From this pool of beta gamma sigma chapters, only the top 10% of undergraduate students, top 20% of graduate students, and some of the most accomplished business practitioners are eligible to be recognized as a member. Saunders College of Business is honored to recognize such a high caliber of our sophomores, juniors, seniors, and graduate students. I would, love, I would now like to welcome Sergeant at Arms, Dr. Erhan Mergen to provide the history of the Beta Gamma Sigma organization. Erhan. Thank you. Beta Gamma Sigma's origin dates back to the earliest years of the 20th century. Erhan couldn't make it last year. Why? I don't know. And this is his last year because I guess. Okay, should I continue? <laughs> I think yes, go for it. All right, um, let me start all over again. Beta Gamma Sigma's origin dates back to the earliest years of the 20th century. During that time, business students were largely excluded from consideration for other societies recognizing academic excellence. As such, three student recognition societies on the campuses of the University of California, Berkeley, University of Illinois, and University of Wisconsin came together in 1913 to establish a national organization which was named Beta Gamma Sigma. This name was chosen to represent the initials of three distinguished business professors at the University of Wisconsin. Over 100 years later, Beta Gamma Sigma is the largest organization in the world to honor business school students and graduates. Beta Gamma Sigma membership is the highest honor a business student attending an AACSB accredited institution can achieve. Members are all over the world and currently reside in over 190 countries. Beta Gamma Sigma members serve in a wide variety of industries and are not focused on one specific professional area. This allows unique opportunities for our members to network with a variety of other business professionals from all walks of life. Thank you, Erhan. Okay. Uh, Members of Saunders chapter of Beta Gamma Sigma, we will now proceed with the induction of our newly elected members. I will present the candidates for induction. Uh, and normally at this time, Dr. Erhan Mergen, who's our chapter Sergeant in Arms, and Alexander Roaring, who's our chapter Vice President, along with Dean Jackie Moserl, would present new members with what you see on your screen, a certificate and a key and an honor cord. Uh, unfortunately, we can't be together this year. Next week, you can stop by Saunders to pick up your Beta Gamma Sigma induction items. There will be a communication sent out after the ceremony with more details on when and where you can pick it up. The key is a symbol of the ideals of honor, wisdom, and earnestness, which you will accept as part of your membership. Okay, members of the platform party, I present this year's candidates for membership into Beta Gamma Sigma that are present here today. They are, I'm going to read each of the names now. Sophomores Kasturi Arujanan, Jonathan Costa, Joseph Kim, Danny Lee, Kobe Matthews, Jordan O'Brien, Kavitha Rajkumar, and Philip Rotkamp. Our juniors are Jameson Frelf, Emmanuel Gorin, Tala Haddad, Andrew Rinaldi and Ruoki Wang. Our seniors are David Lindbergh, Stephen Lynch, Linda Ochiang, Vincent Serrano, Jan Wang, and Clark Young. And finally, our master's students, Natalie Anderson, Caroline Becker, Claire Candelori, Leanna Donsky, James Gross, Monsi Gupta, Naomi Hanig, Aaron Harder, Tommy Kane, Rachel Nemeth, Bell Nguyen, Ryan Noble, Catherine Osmankowski, Maya Smith, Aaron Strand, Megan Tuma, and Michael Weiss. Finally, our executive masters Bradley Brown, Lauren DeHamer, Donald Roach, Ryan Schuler, and Brad Wargula. Okay, if I have just read your name, you have been honored by an invitation to membership in Beta Gamma Sigma because of what you have achieved in scholarship and service, 
we are honored to have you join us. Beta Gamma Sigma is the Scholastic Honor Society dedicated to principles and ideals essential to a worthy life, as well as to a commendable business career. The mission of the International Society of Beta Gamma Sigma is to encourage and honor academic achievement in the study of business, to foster personal and professional excellence, to advance the values of the society, and to serve its lifelong members. The principles of Beta Gamma Sigma are represented by three Greek words, the initials of which form the name of our society, Beta, Gamma, and Sigma. Hear now what Beta means to us from Sergeant at Arms, Dr. Erhan Martin. Beta is the initial letter of the Greek word bebios, which signifies honor. Honor is personal integrity and excellence of character. It is an enduring quality found in all persons who deserve to lead others. All honorable persons conscientiously seek to recognize, to uphold, and to encourage that which is ethical and that which is just. With humility, they acknowledge human failings, which tend to induce the sacrifice of lofty ideas or base gains. They are aware of the difficulty of distinguishing right from wrong when confronted by a variety of alternative goals and a multitude of pressures and means to achieve these goals. But their honor is coupled with resolute courage. They may falter and they may fail, yet they rise with renewed determination to do what is right. Their reputations are their most priceless possessions. All honorable persons recognize their duties before they demand their rights. They respect law and promote order, not because of a negative fear of sanctions, but because of an affirmative conviction that a good society requires the stability which order provides. Worthy members of Beta Gamma Sigma consciously seek to act honorably at all times. Thus, they confidently pursue peace of mind and happiness for themselves, even as they serve as an example for others. Honor is a guiding star which encourages altruism, enlightened social responsibility, and service rather than selfishness. I ask you to accept honor as an ideal to be translated into reality in your conduct every day of your life. Thank you. Thank you very much, Erhan. Listen now to the explanation of Gamma from Chapter Vice President Alexander Roaring. Gamma is the initial letter of the Greek word gnosis, which means wisdom. Wisdom is knowledge tested by experience and tempered by discerning judgment. It abhors prejudice. It insists upon freedom of thought and expression. Truly wise persons are aware of their talents and achievements and do not deny or belittle them with misplaced modesty. However, they are also acutely aware of their own limitations and are sympathetic to the shortcomings of others. They are quick to acknowledge their profound dependence on masters who have gone before them. They laud those who have laboriously built earlier civilizations and they gratefully accept the rich intellectual and cultural heritage they have provided. They are moreover thankful for, for contributions to their development made by family and friends, by superiors and subordinates, by associates and antagonists. Persons of wisdom constantly seek a better comprehension and more fruitful application of what is known. They are also endlessly engaged in a quest for understanding of what is unknown. Although the fund of human knowledge has literally multiplied in recent decades, the wise person happily anticipates a future which promises to provide a geometric expansion of this treasure store. Confronted by a veritable flood of facts and concepts, the person of wisdom exercises special discrimination to select, to arrange, to relate, to interpret, and to apply. This is a challenge worthy of the finest mind. I ask you to continue your quest for wisdom, nurture it and utilize it in your conduct every day of your life. Thank you, Xander. Listen finally to the explanation of Sigma. Sigma is the initial letter of the Greek word spude, which means earnestness. Earnestness is enthusiasm measured by achievement disciplined by reason and ennobled by sincerity. It is that dynamic quality which is essential for all great achievement. 
Earnest persons reject both temerity and timidity. They have the courage to match their convictions. They inspire confidence, invite action, and generate progress. Without earnestness, both honor and wisdom lose much of their potential effectiveness. Noble purposes defined with wisdom and upheld with honor remain evanescent dreams without the driving power of sensible enthusiasm. The greatest personal achievements are tributes to the blending of honor, wisdom, and earnestness in the minds and hearts of those who lead. Rewards for the individual and progress for society surely proceed from this wholesome union of qualities. To each of you, much has been given in mind and body and spirit. And of each of you accordingly, much is expected. Earnestness will help provide the perseverance that dispels weariness, the forward thrust that overcomes opposition and the resilience that rebounds from reverses. To the earnest person, problems become opportunities for service and profit. I ask you to accept earnestness as a guide and stimulant in your personal conduct every day of your life. You have now heard the principles which members of Beta Gamma Sigma endorse and strive to uphold, honor, wisdom, and earnestness. I'm gonna ask you now to turn on your microphones and respond uh, with my prompt. So new members, do you accept these principles as your own? If so, please say, I do. I do. I do. I do. I do. So please, do. Leave your, wonderful. Please leave your microphones on and repeat after me a statement in which you formally accept the principles of Beta Sigma. I'll lead it. I'll lead you through it uh, one phrase at a time to make it manageable. So repeat after me. I pledge myself to maintain and uphold. I pledge, I pledge myself, myself to maintain and, and uphold. And uphold. That's pretty good. <laughs> the ideals and principles of Beta Gamma Sigma. The ideals and principles of Beta Gamma Sigma. The Scholastic Business Honor Society. The Scholastic Business Honor Society. Nice. I will guard and cherish honor. I will guard and cherish honor. I will strive ever to acquire wisdom. I will try ever to wisdom and use it for the betterment of mankind. And use it for the betterment of mankind. I will cultivate earnestness in all my undertakings. I will cultivate earnestness in all of my undertakings. As a member of this chapter of Beta Gamma Sigma, as a member of this chapter of Beta Gamma Sigma. I will recognize my obligation to assist and cooperate. I will recognize my obligation to assist and cooperate in the development of its purposes. In the development of its purposes. I, I will seek by all honorable means. I will seek by all honorable means to advance the interests of the college and the university. Of my community and of my nation. Of my community and of my nation. New members, do you affirm this pledge? If so, please say, I do. I do. I do. I do. Uh, wonderful. You can turn off your microphones. <laughs> Congratulations. Uh, you are now officially members of, Be of Beta Gamma Sigma. In recognition of your accomplishments, and of your pledged high ideals, we will uh, soon be giving you the key to Beta Gamma Sigma, which as we said a few minutes ago, is a symbol of the ideals of honor and wisdom and earnestness, which you have just accepted. So for our last activity, it is my pleasure to introduce Dean, Dr. Jackie Mosrell. Uh, she is the Dean, of course, of Saunders College of Business. This is her sixth induction ceremony with RIT Saunders College of Business chapter of Beta Gamma Sigma.
Jackie brings a wealth of academic leadership and university experience, including over 20 years of service at Rochester Institute of Technology. Please, jo please join me in welcoming Dean Jackie Mosro. Jackie. Thank you, Vic. Thank you. I, I am, uh, I'm so happy to be here today with all of you to uh, recognize your accomplishments during this ceremony. We've heard from Dr. Parati and Dr. Mergen and Mr. Roaring, the meaning of beta gamma sigma. And I would like to address these qualities just a little bit more within the context of Saunders College. Beta or honor requires having a strong sense of ethical behavior and integrity. While at Saunders, you learn the purpose of business before applying the knowledge and thinking skills that you learn in a course like business, business ethics. Become confident with the person you are developing into and look to your Saunders mentors when you are faced with an ethical crossroad. Gamma or wisdom, let me quote Confucius. By three methods, we may learn wisdom. First, by reflection, which is the noblest. Second, by imitation, which is the easiest. And third, by experience, which is the bitterest. Being wise beyond your years is a compliment. It requires you to listen, lead, and learn. There is wisdom in excellence. And there is wisdom in all of you. And finally, sigma, earnestness means serious and purpose. As leaders, we need purpose. We strive to build, improve, drive, multiply, and have a positive impact. At Saunders, our mission is to elevate our students through career-oriented experiences, teaching, and research that will have a lasting impact on the business community and that you will have a lasting impact on the business community. When you leave here today, think about the meaning of these words and how you will uphold your promise. I would like to add my congratulations to you for this accomplishment. Dr. Parati. Thank you, Dean Mosrell. Please also accept my and our sincere congratulations and welcome to the Beta Gamma Sigma chapter at RIT. We're very grateful that you took the time to attend our Beta Gamma Sigma virtual induction ceremony today, and we are at the end of it. Uh, I just simply wanna to say to the students as we close that uh, we're very proud of you. Uh, this is a, a point of pride for all of the faculty and staff at Saunders. This is a significant accomplishment. Thanks for attending today. Uh, I will stay online a little while longer if there are any questions or conversation. Otherwise, thanks and again, congratulations. Thanks, Vic. Thank you. Congratulations, Thank everybody. You. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Well done. Good job, Gabby. Thanks for, for everything. No problem. Thank you. This went very well, I thought. <laughs> Thank you, Vic.